Perkin Pharmacy manages patient adherence primarily through effective communication. And so with regards to our interactions with patients, we really try to make it so that our engagement with patients is proactive and tailored to their needs. And so a lot of times, you know, it's easy to treat a refill reminder, for example, as kind of a robot rote action. And, and it's important for pharmacies to step back and use those points of interaction to really promote adherence. And what we found is that it's important to tailor our adherence strategies and to track what we're doing and then to adjust based on what we're seeing works. And that means changing you know, the, the method of communication or the frequency of communication based on particular patient populations. Um, Bergen Pharmacy also has learned that effective adherence isn't just about communicating with the patient though. And really, there has to be robust communication with the provider and with the payer and uh, an attempt to really bridge those communication barriers. And so, uh, you know, one example is if you're finding a patient who's not, you know, patients are not doing well on a particular medication, you see that a prescriber is insisting on a non-formulary medicine, is there a way the pharmacy can play a role in sort of communicating that to the payer, making sure that the patient gets the medicine that they'll do better on and can adhere to and get, you know, that medication is paid for.